So we're kind of look on how to adjust some poses, presets. Let's look on a little bit more defined um, way how you can manipulate with the poses. And we'll look more on scenes and parameters uh, pane. See how we can utilize this to refine some elements and compare with the editor of the shaping. So example, right here we have a Genesis male figuring. Let's preload it. Okay, and for example, I want to work with a face. So I'm going to select and click on the shapes. Okay, maybe, you know, just adjusting. And let's go, we don't have presets. We'll go inside the editor. And you notice right here we have overall scale. And I had real world. We have the feet, waist, mouth, and head. So if we do... Let's go inside the scenery and right here, you notice we have a genus male. We can expand all the properties. Okay, let me go ahead. Just expand all of them. And you'll notice when we select, for example, head, we can modify it if we access to the properties. So, okay, let me go ahead and chest, neck. And right here and it's kind of child parent relation so it's going towards this so if we select head you'll notice right here we have a right eye and left eyes as example so in this case if we select right eyes and you notice box is enabled so I can we can modify with our gizmo I'm just going to switch to the uh, surface selection tool so it's kind of a little bit hide away this gizmo so we can look a little bit better and when I select right eye, I switch to the parameters tab. Notice right here, I also select uh, my right eye. And in this case, I can switch rotation scale. So for example, if I switch, I can move this eye and you can see left and right. I want to find specifically just to this one. However, it does not have some of those genesis effect of the properly scale in everything. For example, if we have the head right here, and with scale, you can see how the mesh and everything work very well together. So in this case, we not necessarily have this effect, but it does uh, allow us to move fine control. So if we make them creating cross eye, we can select, for example, different eyes. Again, you notice how parameters synchronize. We can create kind of more cross eye if you want it. Okay, so let's go back. Okay, let me re reselect right eye. Then we can place this as well. So you notice beside the center, if you want directly, you can select to all trees, coral, draw all the properties, expand if they need it, and select directly from this point. So this way, in our right pane, we can have it more um, effect and see more in tree structure, browsing through our model structure, and directly access to more defined parameters.